had no idea I wanted to be a doctor. No one in my family has ever been one, and I thought that I would just be a biology teacher and coach water polo, because that's what you do after you play in college. And um, as I went through biology courses and my advisors encouraged me to think about medicine, I learned I, more and more that I liked it, and I liked helping people and working with people, so I just kind of fell more and more into it. I grew up in California, played a lot of sports, a lot of time at the beach. Um, but after that, and after my time in San Diego in undergraduate, I went to medical school at Wake Forest University in North Carolina. After 10 years in North Carolina doing medical school and general surgery training, uh, we wanted to get back to the western part of the country. And so my husband and I moved to uh, Seattle to do my vascular surgery fellowship and have spent two years there. And we, well, some of the things we really love doing together are outside activities, hiking, uh, biking, taking our dogs out for walks and runs and hikes and lakes and you name it. We have two golden retrievers, Augie and Pismo, and they're both just about two years old at this point, and they're our constant companions for anything outside. And we actually uh, had, a while back, they had a litter of 10 golden retriever puppies, so that was a little adventure. Sit down, sit. Cool. And uh, when looking for jobs, Colorado came up as one of the places that had everything we were looking for. The thing I really like about vascular is the detail in the surgeries, uh, whether we're doing endovascular uh, and it's the details in the planning and the prep ahead of time, or whether it is doing uh, open surgeries and the fine detail and skills it takes to accomplish those successfully. I love that it's one of the surgical specialties that where we can keep having a relationship with our patients. I think one of the unique aspects of the program I trained at for vascular surgery, the University of Washington program, is that one of my mentors, Dr. Ben Starnes, is uh, one of the world experts in fenestrated aortic repair. And so we have a very uh, expansive experience with that as trainees and become, I think, to a certain degree, very comfortable with it in, in this unique skill set that not a lot of uh, graduating trainees have. My philosophy as care is to be very patient-centered and to really focus on getting the best outcome we can for the patient for what their goals are. And it's really important to take time to make sure the patients are educated and understand what's going on uh, so that we can make sure we make the right decisions for them. The Vascular Institute of the Rockies is a wonderful team of physicians and advanced practitioners that are really focused on doing the right thing for the patient. They all are renowned for having excellent patient care and surgical care and just a wonderful team approach to making sure they take the best care of the patients that they can. And I'm uh, excited to be a member of a team like that.